What's up guys? So today I want to talk about seasonal sadness. I don't want to say depression because you might not be diagnosed with depression and this is for everyone who feels that down feeling when it comes to winter and the dark times and not getting as much sun and feeling so tired and lethargic and sad. And this is a way that you can step into spring and step into a more empowered you. First, I want to say that seasonal sadness and seasonal depression is a real thing and I feel you because I I feel that every day in my soul when it's winter time and it's dark out and there's not as much sunlight and it's hard to get out of bed it feels like you're lifting your two feet with cement blocks on them getting out of bed I feel that like I know what you feel and this is video this video is here to help you to get out of that to step into a more empowered and loving you because I know you want to be that if you're watching this video I know that is something that you truly truly want in your soul and this is exactly what can help you and so I want you to know that you are not alone in the seasonal sadness and seasonal depression it happens to so many people and it sucks right it totally sucks to feel that way and so that's why I wanted to make this video so here are some things that you can do to feel better about yourself now that it's springtime the first thing that you can do is get outside, get some vitamin D, get that sunlight to make yourself feel so much better. Vitamin D is so good for your mood. So ways that you can do this is just go on a walk. Take your lunch break and go for a 10 minute walk outside. Bring some sneakers to work and go for a walk, listen to a podcast, listen to some of my videos, whatever it is that makes you feel good. But get outside and get moving and get in the sunlight. Now the second thing you can do is regarding mindset and what you can do with this is you know when a situation happens to you you can either take the stance of being a victor or a victim so you can take the stance of being a growth mindset or a fixed mindset now if you're in a growth mindset you're constantly elevating you're constantly up leveling and becoming more empowered more confident learning more you're growing more right but if you're taking the victim mindset and the fixed mindset you're gonna stay exactly where you are you might feel negative you might feel lethargic you might feel tired these are things that happen when you're not growing and you're not up leveling and stepping in to that power self that you totally are the third thing that you can do is just start something new start something that is exciting to you start something that you haven't done in so long whether it's art or journaling or um, some sort of physical hobby doing any of those things starting something new will make you feel like you're in a new season a new you a new stage of your life and that is so amazing when it comes to spring because spring is a season of growth right thank you for watching I am so glad that you are here and I sincerely hope that this helps you feel better it helps you step into a happier and healthier you so if this is something that might resonate with you that you think could help you I would love for you to go to www.besoulchasers.com slash soul chaser apply and you can apply to speak with me if this is something that you want to do if you want to up level yourself if you want to become the healthiest happiest version of yourself without a doubt if you knew that it would happen I want you to go to that application page and apply to speak with me I only have some limited spots so don't hold back I don't want you to wait and not get a chance to work with me and to become that person that you know you want to be so go to that link and click there to apply to speak with me have a wonderful day and be a good soul